All right, so this is Free Code Camp, MongoDB, and Mongoose Part 2. Um, you should still be building off the same database that you created in Part 1. It'll be necessary uh, to complete Part 2. This is uh, CRUD Part 1, so we're going to create. And as you can see here, we're going to create a model called Person from the Person Schema. Um, right here, Free Code Camp gives you. Uh, what's going to be needed, name, age, favorite food. Um, so go ahead and go to Replit. Uh, you should already have an account. And remember from the last part, so you should have this constant here, dot env, uh, so that it uh, basically provides a path or a guide to your uh, EMV file. That way you don't have to uh, mess around with using the uh, the secrets um, over here. So as long as you have this, then you won't need to worry about using the secrets uh, portion. Um, let mongoose equal require mongoose, so you're requiring mongoose. And then if you're uh, basically using their boilerplate, um, let person already exist. Uh, delete that that already exists for let person and supply your own so let person equal mongoose dot model um, and then open parentheses person comma people schema um, up here you're going to keep this this is how it connects to your um, mongo database and then this is the new code so just like it says let people schema equal new mongoose schema um, you have your name, uh, which is going to have a type uh, string, and then required true, uh, comma, age, which will be a number, comma, and then favorite foods, um, and then we're looking for a string. And once you have all that, go ahead and run it, um, copy the live link, and then Go back over to free code camp, uh, plug it in here, and it should pass. All right, thank you.